What's going on, everybody? Weston Hotcoats from the Green Bay Press Gazette, joined alongside Mike Vandermoss and Pete Doherty. Mike, uh, one of the big stories that popped up out of the Packers was not anywhere near Ray Nitschke Field. Uh, Donald Driver now making comments about Aaron Rodgers. Uh, to give you the Spark Notes version, basically just saying if a receiver runs a bad route, it should be up to the quarterback to take a aim for it instead of the player because you don't want to put him in that position. What do you make of all this, <laughs> and is this ever going to stop? Wes, am I the only one who's grown weary of this situation you got Greg Jennings spouting off and now Donald Driver and you know let's go down the list of former receivers and see what they can say about Rodgers and his leadership ability and he does this or he doesn't do that frankly I'm a little tired of it but I know it, it generates a lot of interest you know people on the internet are there's a buzz on Twitter about it I mean in my mind um one thing I agree with Mike McCarthy, who said, I don't really understand what Donald Driver was getting at, because McCarthy was shown the transcript, I believe, and I'm kind of in that camp. I, I don't quite know what he meant, and then later on he denies that he was ripping on Rodgers, you know, so it, it's become a soap opera, and I'll be glad when we can just put it to bed and put it behind us. So, uh, you know, as far as how it's going to impact Rodgers now, I don't think it will. Similar to what he did with Jennings, he's just going to put it to the side and say, hey, things I can't control, I'm not going to worry about. I'll worry about what's in this locker room. Well, in that locker room, Pete, we are dealing with a very interesting Green Bay Packers defensive line group and competition considering they brought back everybody who finished the last season on their roster. They're all back this year. You add in Johnny, Gile, Johnny Jolly and then also two draft picks. Uh, how deep is this D-line right now, and is that something that you think can be a benefit for the Packers this season? It looks like it went from... Uh maybe their greatest weakness last year to a moderate strength at least. And I think their inside pass rush could be better with, uh, you had Dayton Jones, who looks like a talented guy. Mike Daniels has been a much better rusher this year than last year. He's made as big a jump as anybody on defense. And then you have Raji and uh, Mike Neal. That's four, you know, pretty decent inside rushers. So they might have a little more juice with the inside rush this year. All right, well, that does it for us at Lambeau Field. For Pete Doherty, he's Mike Vandermoss. I'm Weston Hockowitz. We'll see you guys later.